Tonight, dramatic new video showing the moment a North Korean soldier risked his life to escape to South Korea. Video showing the man sprinting from his Jeep toward the DMZ, which separates the two Koreas. Four North Korean soldiers then appear, firing shots at their fleeing comrade as he darts into South Korea. The man is hit several times and lies motionless on the ground, with South, Kore South Korean soldiers eventually pulling him to safety. Benjamin Hall live in London. Benjamin, how did this North Korean soldier pull this off? Yeah, good morning, Sandra. I mean, first, first of all, an incredible amount of bravery. This is the most heavily fortified border in the world. Tens of thousands on troops, of troops on both sides. And this shootout, together with this recovery, is worthy of a, one of the great Cold War dramas. It started at around 3 p.m. on November the 13th as this jeep speeds towards the border. It crosses what is known, or was once known as the Bridge of No Return, where prisoner exchanges once took place, before then getting in stuck in a ditch right before the the border. The North Koreans respond quickly, emerging from various buildings in the joint security area and sprinting after him. They catch up to him right on the border and they fire 40 rounds at close range and he falls down on the South Korean side. It's about 40 minutes later that two South Korean soldiers crawl up to him, grab hold of him and drag him to safety. Now this was only the fourth defection across the DMZ in three years. It's the first cross-border shooting in more than three decades, and the U.S. military have said that it is a real violation of the armistice between the two sides, not just because the North Koreans fired across into the south, but because one North Korean soldier actually chased him across before realizing where he was and running back. But incredible, incredible footage. Sandra. Unbelievable watching that play out there. And as you saw those South Korean soldiers dragging the North Korean soldier to safety, what more do we know about that soldier's condition? Well, crucially, we know he's going to survive. The doctors have done a number of surgeries on him. They've removed some of the bullets. He was shot five times. But it was while operating on, on him that they discovered another incredible thing. He was riddled with parasites, some over 10 inches long, unlike some they've ever seen in the past. And they say that this is evidence of the terrible living conditions and poor nutrition in North Korea's military. Not only that, but his doctors say he is now awake, he is now talking, and he's watching American movies, including Transformers, and Bruce Almighty. So not only has he survived this incredible feat, but he's also waking up now to an incredible new world. And that also is going to take some getting used to. Sandra? What a story. Benjamin Hall, thank you.